All right, guys, I have another really interesting scam that somebody had sent over to me. Now, this is an interesting one because it could definitely happen in many different forms, but let's check out the video and then we're going to analyze it. So let's go. <laughs> So without even speaking the language, we know exactly what's going on here. Basically, these kids kind of set up shop in the middle of this maybe busy pedestrian or motorcyclist pathway. And what they do is they throw their bike, which was already broken, onto the ground and then accuse the person who is you know, maybe coming up. This person happened to stop pretty quickly, so they didn't even tap the bike. But then they say that it's 100% the person's fault that's coming down and they're going to want some sort of compensation for it. Now, this happens a lot of places. So if you see somebody maybe bump into you with a glass jar and it falls to the ground and then they start making a big stink about it and get all up in your business and try to extract money from you, you then can maybe talk to the local police that's nearby and say, hey, I'd love to get this kind of worked out with a police officer. And usually in that case, they will just walk away. However, in this case, it looks like they're kind of in a little rural area, so that may not have been the case. Luckily, this person got it all recorded and obviously speaks the language as well, so that helps. So if you guys have run into this, no pun intended, I'd love to hear about it in the comments below. Just put it down there. Maybe there's a different variation that we're not aware of. And also, if you guys have not heard of my podcast, it's called Faked. It's available everywhere. We talk about counterfeit stuff. We talk about scams. We talk about con men. I'll see you guys there. Bye.